A very long time ago, there was a fella named Noah. He was a pretty cool dude. One day, Noah figured out that there was gonna be a huge flood, and so he decided to build, like, a really big boat. And then he went around and gathered two of every kind of animal, from pigs to cows to wither skeletons. Wait a minute. And he got all of these animals onto his boat, and just when he did, it started to rain. And I'm gonna try and do all of that in Minecraft. So in the Bible, it literally specifies exactly how big the boat was, which means if I truly want to replicate this big boat, I have to build it perfectly to scale. But that's still not even the hardest part, because I still have a ton of mobs to pack into this boat. 81 different mobs, to be exact. In the Bible, the boat was about 500 meters long and about 50 meters wide. But we're in Minecraft, which means I need to find a way to translate meters into blocks. Oh. I mean, that's pretty easy. I may have forgotten to mention this, but I am absolutely atrocious at, at building things. So attempting to build an ark that big may prove to be a little bit tricky. Is that a pink sheep? I need to get some wood. First of all, I think the boat is mostly going to be built out of oak wood. So I just kind of completely just deforested this forest. Sucks to suck, man. But on top of that, I'm gonna need several stacks of spruce wood, too. Only problem is I have no idea where a spruce forest even exists. I'm gonna build the outline of the boat really quick. I don't think this boat is gonna take forever, but I'm pretty sure that the real challenge is gonna be getting all of those mobs in here. And yes, yes, that includes the weather. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, oh my lord. This is going to take forever! The giant outline kind of scared me a, a little bit, and so I decided that it was time to turn around and face the mountain behind me. I needed a lot of animals. And the wither. I almost forgot. Okay, we're just gonna start by knocking out some of the easy ones. Cow, pig, horse, sheep, chicken, dog, cat, whatever this is, llama, I shall name you Post Malone. I lure two of every single animal up into my boat just like the Bible story, and don't worry, it's okay. The animals don't understand what's happening to them. It's just Minecraft. But then I ran into a problem. Villagers. I hate these guys. They're so ugly. The nearest village to my home is over 3,000 blocks away, which basically makes this one of the hardest parts of getting two of every mob into my ark. I experimented with many different methods of transporting villagers, including boats and nether travel. Oops. But ultimately, I decided that minecart travel would be the best option. So that means now it's time to build a 3,000 block long minecart track to transport two stupid villagers back home. Sorry, last one. And now we just need two villager fellas. I have come to invade your home. Just please get in the boat. Please. P pretty please. Now just get in here. Boom. See you later, buddy. Wha How did this get here? <laughs> well, here we go again. Moment of truth. And we did it. Let's go. Welcome home, guys. And by home, I mean your new home. You live here now. Alright, I'm in the mood for another little challenge here. In fact, this might be the biggest challenge of all. There's an ancient city just a couple hundred blocks away from home, and I still need two wardens inside my boat. The only problem is one wrong move and I will instantly die. But I'm sure I'll be fine. God dang it. This is a little trickier than I thought. I dug myself a little staircase, and I basically just gotta lure these guys up the staircase to the surface. Oh, there he is. Guys, what are we thinking about for names? What are we naming this fella? I'm feeling Jerry. I don't know. Jerry, we're friends, right? All right, Jerry. Right this way, bud. Jerry, you're doing phenomenal, okay? I'm so proud of you. Jerry, come on, man. Jerry, why? This is the scariest thing, but we are almost there. Jerry, why? 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 Please. Yes! Ugh, I don't get paid enough. But I mean, I guess the least you could do is subscribe, you know? I was pretty proud of my progress, and knocking out some of the trickier mobs had me really motivated, and so I decided to move on to something different. Nether mobs! Don't know if you noticed yet, but I'm kind of highly avoiding building this boat. I didn't realize how big it actually has to be. And I am kind of terrified. But this, this isn't exactly gonna be easy either. Piglin! Blazes! These guys! Strider! Magma cubes! Piglin! Brute! I haven't the foggiest idea what these are even called. I still had 66 mobs left on the list, but to be honest, I was feeling pretty good about myself. There wasn't much in my way besides the wither. And it felt like it was going to be smooth sailing the rest of the way. I did it, guys. Are you proud of me? I have started to work on the boat. Man, I, I'm just the best. I'll be honest, it, it doesn't look like much right now. You just gotta trust the process. But look at it. We have a boat. Not sure. It doesn't it doesn't really look like it would float if you put it in water, but we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Speaking of water, uh, we should probably address Doomsday. Little Mac, what is Doomsday? Doomsday equals the flood. 
And in the Bible, Noah didn't have very much time to prepare, which means seven days from now will be the flood. And I still don't even have an ark built. I'm actually silly. I've only got seven days left, and before I know it, the flood will be here. If I'm actually gonna find these last 66 mobs, I'm gonna need a little help. Emerald! Hi. This is my best friend, Emerald, and I'm gonna force him to work for me. Look, 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 look. I mean... What in the world? But as I explained to him what I was doing, Emerald made a really good point. Wait, but how are we gonna get a mushroom if we haven't even found a mushroom biome yet? Uh... Emerald had pointed out a very big flaw in my plan. I've explored thousands upon thousands of blocks in my world, and I have never came across a single mushroom island. Which is very, very bad, because this is the only place where mushrooms spawn, which, of course, is one of the animals I need. Oh, golly. Oh, golly. There has to be a way. There's no way it ends like this. There's gotta be a way, right? There's gotta be a way. Can I turn you into a mushroom? I, I cannot. I didn't really have an immediate solution, so I decided to continue gathering some nether mobs. But after a few minutes, I got lost and decided to make myself a new portal. Where the flibbity jig am I? <gasps> Wait a minute! I have an idea! Here's what we gotta do. We're both gonna travel thousands of blocks in different directions in the nether, and then we'll make a new portal and check if there's a mushroom island nearby. And if not, we'll just go back to the nether and repeat this process until we've literally covered the whole planet. Okay, bro, please don't make me do all that. Nothing in my portal. Anything there? Yeah, there's no island here. No mushroom island. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing here. Anything there? No, nope, no mushrooms. What the flip? There's no way. Yes! I, 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 there's no way! <laughs> I actually thought it was never going to work. Oh, oh my god. Oh, it's so beautiful. And we're only like 5,000 blocks away. Yay. Hi, man. Wow, you're red. And you're mine now. I created a dirt pathway just for the cows and then led my new friends all the way back to the nether. Oh, that... That is awkward. We're just gonna... We're just gonna leave him here? I don't think anyone's gonna know. I feel slightly bad. Check. We, we have, have mushrooms. mushrooms. Uh, what? Mushrooms. Mushrooms. Why'd I say mushrooms? Things are going great. I couldn't be happier right now, even though some of the hardest mobs are still on the list. Because even though I still got things like the Wither and a Ravenger on the list, I've also got some fun ones like... <laughs> polar Bears. <sighs> Camels. Man, it's hot. Alays! These guys are my long-lost cousins. Frogs. Pillagers. Uh, this one sucked. Turtles! I like turtles. And pandas. And like usual, I guided two of each animal back home, and before long, day six had come to a close. There is now only two days until the flood, and I've still got a ton of work to do. It's making me a little nervous working against the clock like this, but I think we can do this. I'm gonna work on the interior of the boat now, because we gotta make this place look nice and homey for these animals. First, I constructed 81 cages, including two large rooms for the wardens and withers. Then I customized every single cage to fit the type of animal. And finally, I had the tricky task of leading every single animal into the boat and into their cages. Check out this nice cage I made for you. You should go inside. You should... You should go in. All right, goodbye. And by the time I was finished building all of this, the day had drained away and the final day was upon us. This is it. Today is the last day. We're already here. I still have seven mobs left on the list, so I need to hurry up. Although, unfortunately, a few of them are still some of the trickiest ones. Oh, and by the way, guys, while this has all been going on, my friend Jerry over here hasn't killed any of my animals. Let's go, Jerry. Can we all just spam the comments with, I love you, Jerry. I didn't steal that from anyone. Your mind's playing tricks on you. First, we got a zombie. Not too bad. Now I need skeletons and spiders. But now I need two creepers. God dang it. We're friends, right, guys? Oh my god. This is the scariest thing. Where'd my other creeper go? Um, hello? Where did they go? Oh, hi, guys. You're back. Welcome back. <laughs> That's it. Video's called off. I got this. I can do this. I got this. I got this. Spoiler alert! I did. I did actually got this. Holy guacamole. I think we did it. I gathered two of every single mob in Minecraft. Holy crap. Oh. I forgot the wither. Holy crap. Guys, I forgot a critical detail. I still need a big black monster. I am immensely distraught. Sing me a song, Post Malone.
Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I need a total of six wither skulls. And let's just not mention the fact that this is literally the last day before the flood. I'm sure everything will work out just peachy. There's genuinely no way. Brother, the third skeleton I kill. Well, this this started out well, but there's also a strong chance that I'm here for like five hours, so. Eventually, after about two hours of killing wither skeletons, I secured my six heads and made my way back to the boat, hoping it wasn't too late. This would be a really awkward time for it to be raining. Oh, crap. Oh my goodness, the flood is here. Guys, the flood is here. I'm leaving you behind. Sorry. Uh-oh, uh uh-oh. Uh All the animals are ready, right? You guys better be ready for the ride of your lives. Okay, we have enough food. Stables are prepped. Oh my goodness, the waters are rising fast, man. Oh my goodness. Okay, roll call. Jerry, you're here, right? He's probably here. Post Malone? Post Malone's here. I gotta freaking spawn my withers. Oh my god. Dude, I can't even see the ground anymore. Oh no. I don't even know if we're gonna make it out of this. It is raining so hard. Emerald? Where are we? Hey, if you're still watching this part of the video, you probably enjoyed it, so if you wouldn't mind, like, sharing it with a friend or something, that would actually help me out a ton. Um, but yeah, thank you for giving this video a chance. I hope you enjoyed. Okay, goodbye now.